Hello everyone. As you know, we are continuing with the first chapter that is women and environment. Under this chapter, today's my topic of discussion is environment and health. As we know, both the topic are correlated. Environment is God's gift given to the man for the better health. But day by day, our health is deteriorated because of environmental deterioration it is correlated okay the uh, uh, pure air soil water and biodiversity enhance the human well-being and health but degradation of these resources leads to the several problem or several diseases the increase in pollution level or increase in degradation level leads to the anxiety, mental stress, cancer and several diseases. In such condition, our body organ work very slowly or the dysfunctioning of body organ we can say. According to the WHO, health is the complete state of physical, mental and social well-being means is mein sari cheeze aa gayi aapki aap se physically fit ho that is not your health health ka matlab hai you are physically fit hona chahiye mental ability bhi aapki achhi honi chahiye saath hi saath mein aapka social well-being means socially aap kaise hain wo bhi usme aana chahiye so this is about the environment and health in environment several factors are there say for example water is there air is there uh, then the soil is there all those factors influence the human health under this study we have discussed several topic according to those topic we uh, discuss one by one how the uh, water influence the human health then soil influence the human health and the water in, uh, sorry air influence the human health okay industrialization and over consumption of resources leads to the such problem leads to um, a health problem or leads to deterioration of a natural environment degradation of environment or habitat loss because of degradation it leads to the effect on agriculture effect on poultry effect on animal husbandry effects on aquatic flora and fauna and it leads to the several diseases uh, such as cancer and infertility leads to uh, our infertility and cancer are more probable disease which causes because of the environmental illness okay uh, we are discuss with the first uh, topic that is water and environment we know water is very essential for the survival of human being not only for the human being water is essential for the growth of plant water is essential for the development of every type of animal so such essential water is get polluted day by day and that's why in india near about 50% of people doesn't have a proper access of healthy water or potable water potable water ka matlab hota hai jo water purify ho ke nal se hamare ghar mein aata hai that is potable water jisko purification process through jo gaya hua hai jo river mein aapko dikh raha lake mein aapko dikh raha that is not the potable water okay then near about 30 uh, 13 million of people died every year because of the impure water means water se unko kuch diseases ho rahe aur unki death ho rahi to near about 80% of diseases occur by the water or jisko hum water borne diseases bolte hain if the sewage uh, non treated sewage dump up into the river body and it increases the organic load it leads to the water borne diseases such as cholera टाइफाइड डायरिया उसके बाद में हिपेटाइटिस दो डिसीजेस आर वाटर बॉर्न डिसीजेस इन इंडिया वाटर द ग्राउंड वाटर लेवल इज आल्सो डिटोरिएटेड और पोल्यूटेड बिकॉज ऑफ दिस लीचिंग और सिपिंग ऑफ केमिकल्स एग्रोकेमिकल्स बेसिकली जो फर्टिलाइजर फार्मर्स आर यूजिंग और एग्रोकेमिकल्स फार्मर्स आर यूजिंग इन देयर फील्ड देयर दोज एग्रोकेमिकल्स और केमिकल्स लीच टू थ्रू आउट द water and it contaminate the ground water and it uh, directly affects on the health of people second point is air and health now air is an universal component why i am saying that universal component ka matlab kya hai ki har jagah pe air common milegi there is difference between water there is a difference between soil quality there is a difference between the flora and fauna but air quality is throughout the world air is 
same so universal component but nowadays air is get more and more getting more and more polluted so it is an universal फंडा हम उसको बोलेंगे तो इट अफेक्ट द यूनिवर्सल यूनिवर्सल लेवल जैसे नागपुर में अगर पोल्यूशन हो रहा है तो इट इज नॉट नेसेसरी कि ओनली नागपुर पीपल कैन सफर फ्रॉम दैट एयर पोल्यूशन इट ट्रांसफर टू द अदर सिटीज बिकॉज इट इज एन मूवेबल कंपोनेंट सो एयर हैव सेवरल पोल्यूशन कंपोनेंट एयर क्वालिटी वेरीज विथ प्राइमरी एंड सेकेंडरी पोल्यूटेंट कंपोनेंट्स प्राइमरी पोल्यूटेंट होते हैं सेकेंडरी पोल्यूटेंट दैट इज वेरी डिटेल सो हम वी आर नॉट डिस्कसिंग हियर तो प्राइमरी अकॉर्डिंग टू प्राइमरी एंड सेकेंडरी कंपोनेंट द कंपोनेंट्स ऑफ एयर और क्वालिटी ऑफ एयर वैरीज एयर पोल्यूशन कॉजेज नियर अबाउट थर्टी मिलियन डेथ टिल नाउ तो बहुत बड़ा एक फिगर हम उसको बोल सकते हैं थर्टी मिलियन डेथ का द वेहिकुलर पोल्यूशन उसमें सबसे ज्यादा होता है सॉक्स नॉक्स हम जिसको बोलते हैं एनओ टू एसओ टू दो कंपोनेंट आर कॉजिंग सेवरल टाइप ऑफ डिसीजेस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल इट कॉजेज द आई इरिटेशन देन इट इज रिलेटेड टू द ब्रॉन्काइटल अस्थमा एंड सेवरल लंग डिसीजेस और डिसऑर्डर एयर पोल्यूशन ऑल्सो कॉजेज द इलनेस ऑफ माइंड इट कॉजेज द ब्रॉन्काइटल अस्थमा ब्रॉन्काइटल अस्थमा इज वेरी कॉमन डिसीज इन एयर पोल्यूशन सिचुएशन स्मॉग प्रोड्यूस बाय एयर पोल्यूशन इट रिड्यूसेज द विजिबिलिटी एंड इट इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर द रेस्पिरेटरी डिसीजेस बिकॉज ऑफ रिडक्शन इन विजिबिलिटी सेवरल एक्सीडेंट ऑकर एंड देर इज अ नंबर ऑफ डेथ इन एक्सीडेंट बिकॉज ऑफ स्मॉग ग्लोबल वार्मिंग गैसेस और ग्रीन हाउस गैसेस कॉजेज द स्किन कैंसर बहुत इफेक्टिव मतलब बहुत ज्यादा चांसेस होते हैं स्किन कैंसर के वाई वी आर एक्सपोजिंग टू द ग्लोबल वार्मिंग गैसेस इन अनहाइजीनिक कंडीशन और इन ओवर क्राउडेड प्लेसेस द बैक्टीरियल ग्रोथ इज वेरी हाई एंड इट लीड्स टू द सेवरल डिसीजेस एयरबॉर्न डिसीजेस सच एज ट्यूबेकुलसिस निमोनिया एंड हुफिंग कप etc now uh, in our syllabus one case study is given in india that is case study of delhi as we know delhi is very much famous for its pollution level it is october 2016 delhi uh, in delhi there is a emergency declared by the government because of the high smog level in that smog level colleges and schools are totally closed for a week and the um, offices also close for the week because visibility reduce in uh, very high uh, content the particulate matter hum jisko bolte pm particulate matter amount in delhi it increases 12 times more uh, to the permissible limit uske jo standard limit hoti hai usse 12 times zyada tha so delhi is an ideal example for the case study of air so uh, several steps are taken to the delhi uh, taken by delhi government to control or to overcome this problem jo basic humko pata hai that is odd even sequence hum jisko bolte hai odd even numbers odd even number kya hota hai on the odd date the odd number vehicles are run in the even date the even number vehicles are run on the रोड मतलब सारे व्हीकल एक ही दिन नहीं निकलेंगे ऑड नंबर के ऑड डेट पे आएंगे इवन नंबर के इवन नंबर पे आएंगे अगेन सेकेंड द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट दिल्ली फॉलोअर्ड दैट इज सीएनजी सबसे वाइड स्प्रेड सीएनजी इज यूज इन दिल्ली लार्ज स्केल पे पेट्रोल एंड डीजल इज रिप्लेस बाय द नेचुरल फ्यूएल दैट इज सीएनजी and then the several industries or polluting industries are shifted out of the delhi then uh, several industries or thermal power station they are switch off in winter season so it will be reduce the air pollution chote jo industries small scale industries are also shifted out of the delhi several steps are taken to overcome this problem and now we see delhi is uh, re- slowly slowly removing from this problem the third point is soil and health health destruction due to contaminated food leads to the in proper practice of agriculture agriculture practice agar proper nahi hui hai to food will be contaminated so, so for example the farmers are using agrochemicals those agrochemicals are accumulated into the soil and ultimately it is enters to the food chain means a contamination of food chain yahan pe ho raha second one biomagnification ek word aata hai biomagnification means 
तो फूड चेन में आपके दूसरे जीन आ जाते हैं या दूसरे केमिकल जो है वो आपके डीएनए के साथ कंबाइन हो जाते हैं दैट इज बायोमैग्निफिकेशन तो सॉइल टू इंप्रूव सॉइल फर्टिलिटी दे आर यूजिंग फर्टिलाइजर्स टू इंप्रूव सॉइल क्वालिटी दे आर यूजिंग सेवरल केमिकल्स एंड दोज केमिकल्स लीड्स टू द अनहाइजेनिक कंडीशन एंड इट लीड्स टू इट इम्पैक्ट ऑन द ह्यूमन हेल्थ सेवरल हेल्थ हजार्स रिलेटेड टू द सॉइल Uh, for example, POPs and uh, some toxic chemicals, agrochemicals. Me toxic chemicals, jo hote hai, those are create gene mutation. Also, sometimes it leads to the gene mutation. One of the famous example of it is DDT uh, was widely used for the killing of mosquitoes. Uh, in our childhood, DDT was only substitute to kill the mosquitoes. Nowadays, DDT uh, totally banned throughout the world, but still. some cows or some uh, goat milk is having the traces of ddt that means it is enters to the food chain or it enters or biomagnification uska hua hai and it is continuously running from one generation to another generation that is the very severe problem related with this soil and health our last uh, uh, point of discussion is <coughs> radiation and health or radioactive substances and health radiation ka matlab hota hai emission of radiation basically the nuclear weapon testing is the source of radiation another source of radiation is the accident occurs in radioactive substances or radioactive industries jo hai usme then uh, next one is radiation causes the gene mutation ye sabse important uska role hai gene mutation ka matlab hota hai the new offspring will be a deform or new offspring offspring will be changed from the पेरेंट जो है उसके तो जैसे एक हिरोशिमा नागासाकी का हमको एग्जाम्पल पता है अभी तक वहां के लोग जो है नॉर्मल नहीं है और नेचुरल नहीं है वहां पे जो न्यूबॉर्न बेबीज है उनमें कुछ डिफॉर्मिटीज होती है दैट इज बिकॉज ऑफ द रेडियो एक्टिव कम्पोनेंट बेसिकली यूरेनियम टू थर्टी फाइव आयोडिन वन थर्टी वन स्ट्रॉन्टियम आर द बेसिक रेडियो एक्टिव मटीरियल इमिटेड फ्रॉम दोज डिजास्टर इन दिस uh video we are discuss what environment and health environment and health with regard to water and health then uh, air and health soil and health and radiation and health in next video we are continue with the next topic of this chapter so like the video and subscribe the channel thank you